Welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is Gordon Frayne. We are back with another video. Today, we're looking at asymmetric bets in the BitTensor ecosystem. Once again, we're talking about BitCast. As always, if you enjoy the content here, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below. Hit subscribe, hit that bell notification icon. And as always, don't forget to grab your completely free copy of The Rise of Bitcoin waiting for you in the description below this video. Grab it now and let's talk about Tau. So I've covered Bitcast a few different times on the channel here, and I've explained how Bitcast works. Essentially, Bitcast is a subnet in the Tau ecosystem using a mining focus for marketing and connecting brands with content creators, just like in this video you're watching right now. I've done lots of explainer videos about subnets in general and also about Bitcast, so definitely search um, Bitcast on the channel. You'll check out those other videos. But essentially, it's using AI to verify creator content matches content briefs that brands are proposing to them. At the moment, they're focusing in on a lot of the different subnets, and subnets are paying Bitcast to get exposure, to get eyeballs, to get attention for their subnets by all of the people content creators exactly like this video that you're watching creating youtube videos about the specific subnet okay as i said a lot of that focus right now is on subnets in the bitsensor ecosystem but the long-term vision is to continue to expand beyond just tau and subnets into other ecosystems and having brands maybe not even just crypto related but ai brands and ai companies paying bitcast to promote their content in with all of the different creators on the network. So Bitcast is essentially providing marketing, marketing services to many of the most promising BitTensor subnets. And one of the big reasons we're seeing price increase with Bitcast at this moment in time is also the fact that you're having agencies now building on top of Bitcast, expanding and bringing dozens and dozens of creators and YouTubers into the Bitcast ecosystem. I'm going to talk about a price prediction for Bitcast in just a moment, so make sure to stay tuned for that. But the content agencies building on top of Bitcast are obviously contributing to the network expanding and growing very rapidly because of the introduction of agencies, allowing more eyeballs to get in front of essentially, or getting more eyeballs in front of all these brands and businesses that are paying Bitcast to promote their services. If I jump over to Tau Stats, we can see Bitcast subnet alpha token has had a pretty good run up in price here over the past number of weeks. And we're currently sitting at 0 0.0065 Tau or about $2.68 when denominated in US dollar terms. Bitcast as a subnet has a market cap of just around 2.59 million US dollars. In my opinion, we are still quite undervalued for the value potential that this subnet brings to the Tau ecosystem. We know that Tau is not the best in terms of getting exposure and marketing, and that is the exact problem that Bitcast are honing in on. And on top of all of that, Bitcast subnet alpha holders who are staking their Bitcast tokens are generating in excess of 258% APY. So this is a huge APY for one of the smaller subnets in the ecosystem, but a phenomenal ROI for anyone who believes in Bitcast and is staking their alpha tokens. So like I said, I want to do a quick price prediction just to give you some context on where I think the price of Bitcast could go. Again, this is not financial advice. I am just one person and this is one person's opinion. Definitely highly speculative. So take all of what I'm about to say with a pinch of salt, but it is more of a thought experiment to think about where Bitcast could go in terms of price appreciation. So like we just saw over on TauStats, Bitcast is sitting at 0.0065 Tau per subnet alpha token. If we think about that in the context of US dollar terms, like we just saw, it's about $2.67 at the current value of Tau. And what I'm thinking is if we see a bull market with a true altcoin season over the coming months, I think Bitcast could increase in price somewhere towards the region of 0.05 Tau. Again, when we look on the chart here, it's not outside the realm of possibility given some of the stuff that happened with the initial subnet launch. Of course, this is some crazy price action and price discovery when we had that initial launch. But 
for the Bitcast subnet alpha token to get up to the 0.05 area, it's not a wild stretch of the imagination to think it could do that by continuing to outperform against Tau, especially if it continues to garner more attention, brings more creators and brands and businesses into their ecosystem, continuing to expand and building upon the amazing price action they've seen over the past few weeks. So again, that would be roughly speaking a 7.65x in terms of its increase in Tau pricing terms going from 0.0065 Tau per alpha token to 0.05 Tau. So hopefully that first piece is making sense to you because the real craziness starts to come in when you think about the potential price that Tau itself could be going to during this bull cycle. Again, if I look at this from a bear case, base case, and bull case scenario perspective, these are the numbers I ran just a couple weeks ago on the channel here. Check out the Tau price prediction. I will make an update for this because I do think it needs to be updated. But essentially, my bear case has Tau getting to about $2,100 at the peak of the market. My base case is us getting to somewhere around $4,300. And my bull case is us peaking out somewhere around $7,300 US dollars. What does that mean for Bitcast? Well, it means some pretty impressive price appreciation. If we think about Tau getting to $3,000 for this example, that would have us landing somewhere between my bear case and my base case scenario. So I'm really being quite conservative here, thinking about the number that we could get to for the price target of Tau specifically. But when we think about where that brings the Bitcast subnet alpha token in US dollar terms compared to today, that gets us to a 150 US dollar price if the Bitcast token is to go to about 0.05 Tau, just like I explained earlier in the video. 150 US dollars compared to today's prices of $2.67 is a 56X from today's prices for the price appreciation of Bitcast during the rest of this cycle as we move towards the peak if the price of Tau gets somewhere in the region of 3,000 US dollars per token. The crazy thing about this particular price prediction is the fact that I did not even factor in the APY from the staking yield. If you left this staking, even just for the next six months, you're gonna get somewhere around 120% return on the subnet alpha tokens that you have exposure to today if you were to purchase them. And so the amount of subnet alpha tokens that you'd actually be holding in terms of um, the price appreciation here, you could actually do significantly better than 56X if we were to get to that $3,000 Tau with Bitcast subnet alpha token getting to 0 0.05 because you're also getting that 250% staking APY from holding and staking the Bitcast subnet alpha token. So I will leave that up to your imagination where the price could actually go to. But I think even with a relatively conservative uh, thought experiment of Tau getting to $3,000 and of course outperformance here of about 7.6x for the price of Bitcast subnet alpha token denominated in Tau terms, you're getting yourself a 56x and that is excluding the staking yield. So definitely something to consider, definitely something to think about. I think the future promise for Bitcast is very important when we think about the context of needing to get more attention and eyeballs in the Tau ecosystem in general. The long-term vision of the founders, Will and Tom, is very much geared towards continuously expanding the Tau ecosystem as a whole, and of course, growing their subnet and making it profitable for miners and contributors. And I think there's very exciting stuff happening with Bitcast in general. That is it for today's video, guys. If you got any value at all out of this Bitcast price prediction, make sure to take just three seconds, drop a very quick thumbs up on the video before you leave. It would mean the world. It helps to spread the good word about the channel, about crypto, about Tau, and of course, about Bitcast as well. Make sure to subscribe, hit that bell notification icon. You've got your completely free copy of the Rise of Bitcoin waiting for you in the description below this video, and we'll catch you in the next one.